Welcome. Here is the build we will be making today. Pause here to view the materials needed. Copy this layout into your world before we begin. Let's get started with the floor. We're using stripped spruce logs. Now let's get the frame of the house started using stripped dark oak logs. Note the block height of the pillars as they are being placed. To start, they are all five blocks tall. These two pillars are three blocks tall. Then back to five tall for this one. Six tall for these two. And then back to five to finish. Now connect them all like this. Note that this part is one block higher. Now we can move on to the second floor. These pillars are all five blocks tall. Connect them all together again. Add a three block tall pillar at the front. Now we can build the frame for the roof. Be sure to follow this part precisely, slow down or pause the video as needed. Connect the top peaks and the framing is all done. Now let's start filling in the walls. We're using only stone blocks to start. Leave cutouts for the doors and windows.
Texture the walls using stone bricks. There is no perfect way of doing this, just try not to have any large areas of either block. It should look similar to this when it's done. Now start filling in the rest of the walls using stripped oak logs, oak planks, and oak stairs. Follow the block placements exactly. Add two stripped dark oak pillars here. We're done filling in the walls. Now let's move on to the windows and doors. Use white stained glass for the windows. Dark oak for the doors.
Now, we can start building the roof. Build the peaks first following these block placements. We're using deep slate bricks and deep slate tiles. Don't forget the upside down stairs here. Fill in the rest of this part to practice before moving on to the main part of the roof. Now let's complete the rest of the roof. Follow the block placements exactly.
This next part can get a bit tricky. Pause, slow down, and rewind the video as needed. This is the most tricky part. Finish the top and the roof is done. It should look like this when it's done. Now let's start the exterior details. Place stripped dark oak logs at the base of the pillars like this. Then cover them with dark oak stairs.
We'll add a small workstation to the side of the house here. Feel free to customize this however you like. Build the roof using deep slate bricks and tile slabs. Now let's move on to the front entrance. Feel free to customize this part as well. The roof is similar to the workstation. Now we can do the flower beds. Pick whichever flowers you'd like. Let's add some window shutters.
then add some chains and lanterns. The exterior is now complete. Now let's get the interior started. Feel free to customize the interior however you like. We decided to add a small staircase here. Then we filled in the second floor using spruce planks. and added some railing here using dark oak fences. We then added a ladder up to the attic and filled in the floor using stripped spruce logs. Trim these two logs back to make it look nicer. Our house is now complete. We will be doing a separate video showing a detailed interior for this house. We're trying to reach 10,000 subscribers and are posting every day until we do. Please give this video a like and subscribe to our channel for more videos.